Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. My name is Cosmina and in today's video we're finally gonna open a Jeffree Star mystery box. I haven't purchased mystery box from Jeffree Star for a year and a half or something like that and I purchased this one because, because this is supposed to have a pink ticket like a like the golden Willy Wonka ticket that is supposed to win certain prizes so if you're interested to see if we got that pink ticket or whatever else is in this <laughs> deluxe size uh box then keep on watching all right so when I first seen this it looked super small I really thought this is gonna look a little bit bigger I thought this is the mini when I looked at it, it was like what did they made a mistake but no it's actually truly the deluxe size I believe it's called so they had a mini a deluxe the mini I think it was 45 the deluxe it was 60 the another one Supreme, I guess it was $100 and then another one it was $180. You're supposed to have six items in here and that is supposed to include one of the uh, eyeshadow palettes because he released a new eyeshadow palette in this box, in these boxes, this mystery boxes. So I'm really interested to see how, what is in here. I'm also going to try them on. That's why my face is pretty much uh bear which i don't have a lot on it but i am uh, i am excited to see what's in here i have not watched any videos because i really did not want to take away from the mystery so here we go we opened it let's see what's in here so let's start with this first little thing this is supposed to be a lip gloss and this is from Shane Dawson collection. Wow. Okay, so this is the... Does it say what name it is? Oh, this is Slime Glossin. And it's supposed to be green. This is how it looks like. The packaging. And here's the uh, gloss. It has a hint of a green in there. I don't know how that's gonna look but let's try it on my lips are a little bit dry it feels really nice on the lips it doesn't transform into green or anything like that so that's cool i like how this looks like so we have a gloss that's good let's continue on and see so we have a bunch of pink wrap in here but well, let's continue on let's see what is this okay so this is a tinted lip balm and i have mine in cowboy kiss this is how the packaging looks like oh i like the packaging on this one nice and it's pretty dark so i'm thinking is that actually gonna look that dark let's clean up this lip balm the gloss and just throw this on mm, it has a little bit of a tint to it but it's not uh too crazy it's not too dark and it feels good on the lips so we have a lip balm as well all right let's see next Okay, so next in here we have a uh, Velour Lip Scrub and this one is in Extremely Yummy? No. This is in Rainbow Sherbet, 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 sherbet I guess. And this is how it looks like. It is pink. It's a pink inside too. No, it's green. Mm, I love the scent of it. Really nice. Okay, so I'm not going to try this because, you know, it's just a lip scrub. And I do not need it right now after I put all those on my lips. So let's see what else is in here. So probably this is, what is this? Is this the palette? 
Uh, so this is a magnetic palette. So I guess we're going to get some blue shades. That we'll see. We'll see what... We'll see what this one is going to bring with. Because if you send something like that, then you have to send some blue shades. Because why would I just need that? You know what I mean? Alright. Alright, so I see some blue shades in here. Uh, we have Priceless, Snack, and Root Canal. And I'm going to put this on that... Um, and I'm going to show this at the end now let's continue to unbox okay so nothing else in here with the exception of this thing so i guess i haven't gotten a pink pink ticket um, well that sucks i was hoping i would get a pink ticket but no so this is the star wrench eyeshadow palette uh, we don't know anything about this eyeshadow palette, but considering the fact that it's Star Ranch, I'm thinking a bunch of browns. So, let's see. This is how the packaging looks like. Has some blue on the package, so that, could it be that it has some blues in it? It does, actually. I mean, it's not a, hmm. I kind of like it. I like the owl eyes and the star creek. It's an interesting, uh, definitely an interesting combination for an eyeshadow palette. Interesting. I'm gonna, we're gonna play with this one too. Now let me put those shades in uh, here so I can show it to you. So here are the swatches for the uh, ranch, star ranch. Which I really like these colors. They feel really soft and they feel really buttery. A really interesting combination. Um, but I do like them. I feel like I can create a nice look using this eyeshadow palette. And I'm going to do that. And here on top, I have the loose shades right here. This is supposed to be Root Canal. Which I have them right in here. Let me show them to you. This is how they look like. I think in this you can fit maybe nine, but you're gonna have some gaps as you can see right there. So, I don't know. Some people are gonna be a little bit annoyed with the fact that it can have gaps like that. But I have Snack is this one right here and I really, really do like it. Root Canal is next to it. And the last one, I think it's called Priceless. Let me double check. Yes, it is priceless and you can create a nice beautiful look with those three. So I don't want to keep you waiting. Let's proceed with this. I'm going to start with this uh, priceless color first and I'm just going to apply that all over my eyelid. And we're going to create a look with both. Just to kind of see what you can come up with with these shades and how they look on our eyelids. Like I like the way it blends. It was nice. It does have a little bit of fallout and some kick in the pan. <laughs> does. So keep that in mind. Also I'm going to go with this purple and see how that's going to go. I think I'm just going to add it maybe all over a little bit in the crease that is actually really nice the way it blends so that I like especially purples I know they're a little bit more difficult to create And then I'm going to go with this uh, pinkish shade and I'm just going to apply that right in the center and uh, see how that looks. I think that's nice. And I'm going to take a different brush and take that priceless shade again and just kind of run that a little bit above to just kind of clean up 
the purpley shade. I think this is a nice pretty look. I do really enjoy it. I'm just going to run a little bit what's left on this on the bottom lash. And that's it for this eye look. Let's go with the Star Ranch and see what it's going to create with. Looking at my arm and my swatches, I definitely know I want to use this Casper Mountain shade because it's such a beautiful and pretty shade. I really like the Star Creek as well. Um, and I'm going to go a little bold today, so we'll see how it's going to pay off. I'm going to start with Wyoming, and I'm just going to add this right up here. Very nice and easy to blend. I like that. We're going to go with Winter Wind, I think it's called, and we're going to apply that right underneath it. just like that and then I'm gonna take Star Creek and I'm gonna apply this um, and I'm gonna apply it right outside here such a beautiful shade I don't think I have this shade in my collection yet and I like it. And then I'm going to take a different brush and I'm going to take this uh, Casper Mountain and I'm going to add that right in inner corner and in center. That is pretty, pretty bold, isn't it? So I'm going to take a little bit of the Yak Farm and I'm going to run this on upper part right here. And because I want to make it a little bit more dramatic, I'm going to take the Wyoming again. And I'm just going to make sure it shows up right over here. I'm going to take the open range and run that in, on the bottom lash. And here are the two looks. This is with the loose ones, and this is with the Star Ranch one. I am actually really happy with how they look like, and I am happy with this purchase. Um, I'm excited to play a little bit more with the Ranch palette, but uh, my first my first thoughts, like initial thoughts, are really nice. It feels really good. It's very soft. It's very easy to blend. You can create beautiful looks. It has some beautiful, surprising shades in there. Also, these are the ones I really like. I like the purple. I like all of it. It's a nice, nice selection. I'm a little bit surprised that I have not received any lipstick. That's weird. Usually, I get a lot of lipsticks in these uh, mystery boxes, but not this time. So pretty much this is what we got today. Let me know down below if you got it. Let me know down below what you think about these looks. Do you feel like it's nice? Do you feel like it's worth it? I'm a little bit disappointed in the fact that I did not receive a pink um, ticket, but you know, it is what it is. It's the chance. Usually I'm never lucky, but sometimes I still, I, but I still keep my hopes high. Thank you so much for being here today. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. We are on our way to 1000 subscriber by the end of the year. Help me reach, reach that goal. I'll see you all next time with another video. Bye now.